Howdy y'all, DJTJ here with Blender Video Editor Tutorial number 6, Transitions. Alright, I'm going to take you through real quick how I would put together one of my YouTube video clips. So right here I'm looking at the folder that has two different little clips in it. One is my screen capture and one is the little intro that I'd already saved and I use for every clip. So what I'll do is I'll left click and drag this down. I like to select this first, the um, audio, and go ahead and show the waveform. I'll come here, I'll hold the shift key while I right click both pieces and then I'll shift K. I'll select these, press delete. Go ahead and shift click both of these pr pieces, press G and move it on down. You can always play to go ahead and listen. Alright, so we will right click while holding shift. Go ahead and press shift K. I'm going to select while holding shift. Press the G. Spread this out some. Then I'll go ahead and put the intro in. Now, notice here at the front of my intro that is a, it is a it starts as a pretty much a white background, and then for this particular clip, it's black. I'd want it to transition nicely into white. I wouldn't want it to go ahead and just like do a very hard cut like that. So the way we can do that and there's several different ways you can do this. This is just the one I'm generally use is that we can go to add effect strip and color and then it'll populate. The default color is black. I want to go ahead and make it white. Let's move that right there. Now we're going to turn we're going to do a little transition between this bottom clip and turn it into white. Now the way you do that is you right click on the clip, then you hold the shift key and right click on the clip. Now it's very important to understand the order you do that. Because if you click on the clip first, then the color fill, it will transition from the clip to the color fill. If this doesn't work for you, something's happening funky like it's very... Um, it just pops in it means you've clicked on the color first and then the clip because what you're telling blender is I want to transition from this clip to this so once again if you don't have anything selected you're going to hold down the shift key right click on the clip then right click on the color next you'll go to add come up and go to gamma cross notice that this little gamma cross pops up if you pull your cursor you can really see that it ends right when the clip does so this is only going to cover up the overlapping parts so make sure when you put your color put it over the part that you want to transition through and of course if I left I'm sorry if I right click this and hold it I can drag that out and make it longer just depending on how long you want your transition to go once you're done moving it you can left click and it'll lock it in place so if I scrub through that you can sort of you can see that it is transitioning to white and now it goes right into my clip so let's go ahead and come over here and select these two pieces by right clicking and holding down the shift key press G I'm going to move them a little closer then I'll put the cursor right at the end right here I will go back and go to add effect strip color once again I'll change the color to white then I will select the color first by right clicking on the color then I will hold the shift key and select the video clip go back to add effect strip gamma cross now here's my gamma cross I'm gonna spread this out quite a bit so it's a nice smooth transition and then if we bring it here go ahead and hit play see how it transitions in. 
All right, so that's how you put those in. You can also put one at the end if you want to fade out to black by simply adding a color, adding a color in, and right click, hold the shift key, right click again add gamma cross and there you'll see it'll fade out to black and then of course you can just end your clip right here by leaving the mouse cursor there checking wh where you're at and then changing that number press enter now my clip is that long see the end line and it will fade out as it plays And that does it for Blender Video Editor tutorial number 6. Please join us for our next tutorial, Audio Editing. Thanks for watching.